Hello, this is Michael, and welcome to the Medlock Method Chinese podcast. 你好，我是邱老师。And what are we doing this week, 邱老师 ？Today we're going to talk about 面子 and 请客 to having guests. Very important in Chinese culture. It is. It is. And I think everybody knows what means is. We understand what it is, the basic idea, but I think we need a bit of explanation of how it applies in、That's、the Chinese、right. culture. Yeah, there you go. Okay, what does means do? Okay, first of all, help us to maintain our PR. Okay, and secondly, okay, it decide how social life, the social life should be、uh, carried out. You know, so it regulates that、uh, how we we do things. So it's relationships between people and the relative importance of different people in society. That's right. Okay.、Uh, for example, having guests is very important to, in Chinese society. So we, let's use it as an example. How does means decide what to do? Okay. okay great. For example, here, 请客的时候，请客时 when we have guests, what we decide to have guests. Okay. Then, what does means do? Means we decide who should be invited. And who shouldn't be invited? So if you don't have mienza, you don't get invited. That's right. <laughs> And not only that, who should be repeatedly invited? What do you mean by that? Because usually, when you have the honor guests, you invite them. They will say, "Oh, don't bother. You know, don't bother. Don't do that for me." But you have to repeatedly invite them,、okay. again and again. So what you mean is that you're not inviting them to different parties so much. Maybe, maybe you are. Of course, yeah. You're constantly inviting them to the same party just to make sure that they come and make sure that they know how important it is that they come. That's right. Okay, so repeatedly to show the importance. Okay, the means the means is very, very big. Can you overdo it? No, never.、Oh. Means is never, never too big. Okay, and who is just told mentions? Oh, we are going to have a party. This is sort of a, an invite that's not an invite. That's right. Okay. So you should not, you should know that your means is not big enough. You know, but you are at the social ladder already. But at the bottom. So it's not necessarily an insult. As no,、such. no. Actually, it should be、uh, honored because you are invited. But you just need to know that、uh, you are only invited not to be invited. Yeah. Come along. Just make sure you don't show up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and when the guests arrive, okay, 客人到的时候 then we have to arrange who should sit and who should stand. Okay, if you are the person mentioned we have party and they show up, you didn't know your face is so small there. <laughs> Maybe there's no no place for you. You might have to stand. Just hang around on the fringes or something like that. What? But. I'm joking here. Okay, we should stand, but、uh, yeah, because we, you know, we have a guest over. Sometimes you know you have only one table prepared, and you have more people to come, and then these people probably would have to wait around, stand, or you just have to have another table, which for those not so important people, not at the main table. So then, who should sit at、uh, the honor seat? I, this one is something that always gets me. I'm never really sure which the honor seat is. Usually, the person who sits、uh, facing the door, and that is the honor seat. Okay. Okay. So, who should sit at the honor seat, and、uh, who is the? Who's the retinue? The retinue. What do you mean by the retinue here? Retinue is、uh, the people who are not very important, but. They are important to be there to entertain. Ah, the court jesters. <laughs> yeah, they their function is to um provide to provide the entertainment, so to suck up the the honor guests and of course the and the host as well. I think I've experienced this before. I've been in situations where. I'm not really sure where I was. Was I the honoured guest or not? Sometimes, yes. Where we have people who are telling stories and things like that, and、yeah. saying how wonderful the host how, is, how Leo is, and, yeah, and how wonderful the the guest is, you know. So this is a this a, a person who has the function, you know, and that, that's why they are there. That's why they are invited to be a good with the storytelling or suck up people, you know, saying things nicely. Yeah, or they are good at clapping. 
Well done, well done, yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this all decided by the means who should do what, who should, where everybody should sit. And also, very important thing is if you are invited by your means therein, okay, so people who has Oh, oh, someone who has face invites you. Yeah. And then, of course, your means. You can sort of uh, tell your friends, someone invited me over, blah, blah, blah. Uh, you know although, you behave it in society then. Yes, yeah. although you, you're probably the person who stands. <laughs> or, hey, at least or, you're standing. You're yeah, inside. Yes, exactly. Or maybe you are the uh, retinue. Mm -hmm. You're one of the court jesters. Yeah, okay. And you don't have, forget to play the role, though. Yeah. Okay. So you have means. Yeah, your means. But the more important thing is, if you has ability, 请到有面子的人 invite someone with strong means or big means, and then you have even more means. You have even more means. Okay. So in the first situation, someone with means invites you. That's good. Yeah. But if you have the the ability to invite someone with more mienza than you do, then it gives your mienza a boost. Exactly. So, you know, the funny thing is, you know, you can see that a lot at uh, sort of um, wedding banquets. And a lot of uh, sort of politicians are invited to talk to the, the guests. And the bride and groom, they do not know them at all. But, but they are there. Because they have means, so you can 请到有面子的人 you can invite them. It's also give this a、uh, wedding, yeah. Oh, you're showing society how much status you have because all these important people who you've never met <laughs> <laughs> are coming along. Yes. Okay. So, and then there's a show to do. You have to play by the means. Ah, the theatre time. Yes. That's right. 请客的人 Are the host? The host. Okay, have to say, 没什么菜，没菜没菜 We don't have any food. It's nothing special. It's that's right. Sorry for giving you this rubbish. Yes, but you know what? Because it's it's a theater to say, look at the tie I order here. So much, so good. But I say 没什么菜 That means I have strong ability. I'm not showing it fully yet. <laughs> I, I could only order caviar. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> And what does he have to do? Over order. This is something I think for Western people we have a real problem understanding. Why do you order so much food that you know that you're not going to eat? Well, to show、uh, the guests that, so that first of all, humbly to show people their ability. Of course, you know, saying "make some tea," but order so much. And secondly, to show the people, the honor guests, that、uh, because you have big means here, that's why I'm doing this for you, subtly. So it's for the honored guests to show that you have means, and for the other guests to show how important you are as well. And you can, yeah, you can spend this money; it's nothing. Yeah. Or if you don't order enough food, or you order just right amount of food, and then you show people that you have. 小鼻子，小眼睛 ，little nose, little eyes. It means that、uh, your eyes are so small, you can see so little. Uh huh. You, so it means that、uh, you know you you haven't seen the world yet. Okay, you're still living you're in the little. You're being stingy. You're you're in the. You're in the little pond, not the big pond yet. That's right.、Okay. Little fish. Little fish. The 请客的人 you have to do this. 没有什么菜 you have to over order, and 被请的人 the guest.